Hey, this is Time Bomb, and if it's your first time checking out the channel, hit that subscribe button to catch all the updates. Thanks a lot for joining me here today. I'm going to do a breakdown on what I think is a play that is slowly coming back and is actually a really strong play that people don't realize again in Madden 19. Remember to give this video a like. That helps out the channel so much. The play that I'm going to be breaking down today is out of the deuce close, and it is the halfback wham. That's right. Halfback wham is back on the menu. And, I mean, it's as simple as just running it. All I really like to do is either ID a DT or possibly a linebacker. I think it might be usering it or trying to cover me there. And then, you know, just snap that ball, look for a hole, run your way up, and make your way to 10. 15, 5, 2, minus 2 yards, whatever the case may be. I find people just aren't used to it, especially in draft champions. It can be really, 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 really strong. Like, I've played whole games where I just basically run wham and then used a little bit of stretch, which is pretty cheesy. I can admit that, but I just find, you know, you gotta, get, you gotta crack those wins when it comes to draft champion if you're trying to get on the leaderboard, which I'm not doing great with, to be honest. I was doing a little bit better, but kind of slowed down. And boom, look at that one. Just find those holes. There's holes all day with this run play. So that's why I like using it specifically in Draft Champion. I haven't, don't have it out of my uh, Bills playbook that I like using uh, online generally. So I have not uh, switched to a different playbook to get it. But, you know, anytime a book in Draft Champions has it, I am definitely going to be scheming out of it. And then the only other thing you really need um, is... You know, then I'll run bench and also the stretch. So then if you do start to see that, um, well, I'll use a halfback zone in this case. I kind of showed it. If you see that they're starting to pick up on the wham, then you run stretch, kind of ID over there, motion your tight end who would motion and wham. And then this time, though, you're going to run it to the outside. They might not see that coming. The AI really smoked me there. But you should be able to throw off some opponents. Maybe they'll pinch. Maybe they'll get used to the wham coming. Um, so... Working on the stretch or some passing plays should catch them off guard if you are using it a whole bunch or even just switching the side of the wham might even help you get a few more yards as well. So that's right, I'm saying it officially, wham is back on the playbook menu. So drop a little bit of wham on your opponent when you can. Let's take a look at some of the gameplay footage I have for this. All right, here we are taking a look at some of the gameplay footage that we have here. And a lot of it's from Mutt Draft, as you can see the Mutt Draft logo on the field, because like I said, it's one of those things that I'm going with there. And a big hole up the middle. So now I'll even draft two running backs just so I can switch them in and out, just you know, keep them fresh. Boom, spin move. It's gonna get me way downfield. You see him click on, just trying to cut off my lane. Look at that. Premature jerk move, jerk move, juke move, then the spin. Look, another spin. Oh, last man desperation dive catches me. I made so many moves there to get open. I can't believe it didn't pay off. Here we go, just finding that hole. He should have tackled me there, and boom, gets free. Basically, he was touched, but un unable to really t take that momentum out, and he gets all the way into the end zone. See here as well, just kind of taking a look at where the user is, running away from him. One man tries to take me down, bullies through it, spin move to get free, and then look at all those blockers. They don't do anything to stop that diving man, but boom, touchdown. See again here from my, like my own 30, spin move, getting him free. He's basically gone. The one man's going to try to catch him. Can't get up to him. He's gone, free, all the way in. Little uh, little hurdle for style into the end zone. And boom, touchdown. That wham has been so deadly. I don't know if you've noticed or if you've had it run against you, but get on it early. Drop some wham on some people. Open up a can of wham on them. And I think you're going to see some good results like this because it has been working for me. You, I mean, you can't run it all day, don't get me wrong, but, I mean, if opponent's not picking up on it, run it all day on them, I guess, until they do. It's a fun play. I like having Wham back, and I, I like that I haven't seen it too much, and I've been running it. So give this video a like if you're down with the content. Thanks a lot for checking out this video. I've been Time Bomb. You guys are awesome. I'll catch you later.